is Tika Panda here and welcome back to Tika Craft Season 2. So I have a little bit of explaining to do for this series. I did have an episode 1 of this series that I uploaded. But um, since that uh, episode I have completely changed the mod pack. And I wasn't actually intending to start the series again for a very long time. But I just I missed it a lot and I did have... I did start a Terraria series, but I just wasn't enjoying it. So I decided, since I don't have very many subscribers, I want to experiment. And, um, you know, since I don't like Terraria, and I found that out, I should start back Teacup Craft. So, here we are! I have a total of 16 mods in this mod pack. Um, all of them will be listed in the description box down below, as well as my resource pack, which, by the way, is Loafcraft, I think is how you pronounce it. Um, but yeah, we just spawned in. I waited here to let the world, uh, load a little bit, and so we don't have as much lag. But let's go ahead and chop down some trees. There are some puppies over here, and they're so cute! I wish I could have one, but I can't. Before we get started, I want to make sure we're on normal. Okay. So, let's start this series off right and grab some more wood. Um, so I'll explain again. I explained this in another series, but basically with Teacup Craft, I started the first episode, I had a really cool mod pack, but then um, I just, you know, I wasn't happy with the series. I was kind of, you know, still debating whether I wanted to use that mod pack, so I changed it up a lot. And I would have just continued on the same world, but I think I have like, maybe one or two of the same mods that I had in that, um, series, but, like, everything else is different, so it would really <clears throat> not work, because the world would be really messed up, and it just would not be wonderful at all, but, um, yeah, I'm really happy to, um, be starting this series again, so let's go ahead and come and grab some of this stone, some with a pickaxe, with some pickaxe, that doesn't really make sense, does it? But let's make a pickaxe here. Start with a wooden one, of course. And grab some stones. So with this, what I've decided to do with uploading and everything is instead of having series that I have to upload, that I have to do, um, I think I've decided I just want to have certain days that I am going to upload, but um, I'm going to upload what I've recorded and edited already instead of just having to upload something and having to get it done and just having to uh, do that was not fun, <laughs> having a deadline and everything. I mean, I know I'm eventually going to have to do that, um, but right now, since I'm a very small YouTube channel, and I want to just have fun with this right now, seeing as it's just a hobby. I want to, um, stick with just doing, uh, maybe two videos a week, and then, you know, just seeing what I feel like uploading, what I've got recorded, things like that. So, we have a full set of stone tools, and now we have a furnace. What I want to get next is some coal. Oh, so we started with this book, by the way. This is from the Tinker's Construct mod. Basically, with the Tinker's Construct mod, you can make tools, your own tools, out of anything you want. And there's a bunch of different types of, like, swords and stuff. And it's pretty cool. I really enjoy it. And I wanted to include it in this mod pack. So let's go ahead and kill these chickens for food. There were some strawberries down here. These are from the Extra Biomes XL mod. Uh, I really like it because it's not like, um, Biomes of Plenty where there's a bunch of scary mobs and stuff, but it's just kind of, you know, adding cute little biomes to Minecraft, which I really, really like a lot. So, you may notice that my crosshair sort of pointer thingy in the center of the screen is a paw, and like all the particles are cats, just because it's a cat resource pack, and I really, really like it. I just like how soft everything is, and how kind of cute and fun. I'm, I don't know, I just like it. I've never seen any other YouTubers use it, but I think it's really adorable, and I like it a lot. So, we're gonna get this coal here. 
And I guess I will talk a little bit more about the mods. I have a dragon mop, dragon mount mod, I think it is, in here. And I'm really excited to use it. I've never used it before, but it looks really, really cool. Um, I also have Pam's Simple Recipe mod. I have a uh, crop guide, because how else would I see how all this stuff is? <laughs> what, how to make all this stuff? Um, uh, let's see what else do I have. I have carpenter's blocks. I have deco craft, of course. You can't go wrong with deco craft. Um, I have, uh, uh, what is it called? Mm, some animals plus, I think it was. So we have lots of animals and all sorts of stuff going on in this mod pack. Again, I'll have all the mods in the description as well as the seed of this world in case you want to play along. That would be super awesome. Uh, and uh, I'm going to kill some more chickens so you can get some more food going. So I'm really excited for this resource, uh, resource pack. <laughs> uh, this mod pack because it has a lot of building sort of mods and I really like building in Minecraft so I think it's gonna be a lot of fun just to build in this series in my um, vanilla Minecraft series that I'm doing right now I want to build a sort of old western town in a mesa so I think in this series I'm gonna do something a little bit different I think the idea of having an ice castle and like a snow biome would be really awesome, but I've never done that before. So it would be a lot of fun just to come up with an, an idea and um, yeah, just do it, I guess, build it. Um, I was going to have the chisel mod in here, but I decided it was just too much and I wanted it to be a pretty light mod pack so that it wouldn't cause a lot of lag on my computer. So we're sticking with a without the chisel mod. So I'm gonna grab some more coal while we're waiting for our chicken to cook. And then once it is completely cooked like it is now, we will grab our furnace and get moving. So I wanna try and figure out uh, where I want to kind of, is it going down? Oh dear, okay, we're in trouble. I need a bed or something to sleep with. Oh, look at all the chickens and the cows. It's good for food, but not for wool. Um, I do not want to be out here at night. Usually what I do is I dig into like a hill or something and sleep in there for the night, but I don't, I guess I'm gonna have to do that again and wait through the night. I dislike doing that, but it looks to be the only thing, the only option. Oh, hello. This is from the Tinker's Construct mod as well. There's some pumpkins down there. We're going to carefully make our way down the mountain into the plains and see what we can find. Another mod I have in this mod pack is the um, Lucky Blocks mod. I... <laughs> really like the mod and i think it's gonna be a lot of fun but we're going to be very careful with it because i don't really want to die too much in this series oh look fish fish they're so cute oh. um yeah okay it's getting dark i understand that's um my sheep finally yay that was very very lucky we can just hit them all with some critical hits, take them out, and make a bed. No, we only have two pieces of wool. <gasps> Where's the other piece of wool? There it is. Okay, we're okay. It's all right. We're okay. We need wood. Oh, we had wood. <laughs> what am I doing? Okay, there you go. Pink bed. Pink bed. Sleep. Ah, alrighty then. And it looks as if we have even more time in this episode to, uh, explore and find places and talk fun another pumpkin don't really need it so we're gonna leave it there so what biome are we in right now anyway we are in a taiga a river uh, oh lucky block lucky block structure yay okay so um this is a good lucky block structure this is a super lucky block i believe oh this is so cool i'm super excited oh those are piranhas let's stay away but i really 
gonna open this one. This is a lucky, a super lucky block. So basically with the lucky blocks mod, if you didn't know, they can be unlucky or they can be lucky or just in the middle. And uh, they randomly spawn in your world or you can make them with gold. And what did you put in? Oh uh, yeah, a dispenser in the middle. Or no, it was a dropper. I don't remember. It's been a while since I've used this mod. Um, uh, but yeah, you can add stuff to it when you craft it to make it either lucky or unlucky. Uh, and they spawn in certain structures depending on how lucky they are. So let's go ahead and open it. What are these? TNT? Oh, what a waste. I don't need that. We can make a big hole. Well, we can't even light it yet. We'd have to make like a lever or something. Ugh, the lag is ridiculous. Uh, here's some sugar cane over here. Let's grab that. Don't really know where we're gonna use that, but we will grab it anyway. Look at a cute little chicken. So cute in this texture pack. Let's grab some strawberries in case we need some more food because we didn't grab too many chickens. Um, we could go in this cave. It's not a bad idea. I don't think. Probably is be perfectly honest uh, but we're gonna be dangerous and do it anyway hey iron yeah, at least we got something out of it right <laughs> so I want to keep these episodes my usual length of video which is 15 minutes and um, uh, yeah I think that's gonna be the regular um, time length but I do want to kind of try doing longer episodes where I collect resources and maybe answer questions if you guys have any um so that might be what we do uh let's grab some of these chickens here we'll have lots of feathers um <laughs> yeah Grab some of this, some surface iron. We're at level 64. And that's, yeah, I think that's the level iron spawns out. I don't think that's a mod. <laughs> horses! 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 Untextured horses! Oh, they're so cute! <laughs> let's make a waypoint here. Let's see. See? Yeah, there we go. I remember the controls. Dark aqua. Let's make it tan or gold to match the horse's color. And we will call this um horses this is our waypoint we can teleport here if we would like i don't know if i'm actually going to use the teleport feature or not <sighs> tell me in the comments or maybe i'll do a poll where you guys can tell me if you would not want me to do that look it's a brown sheep it's a brown sheep cute brown sheep okay so let's get a move on let's exploring i guess <laughs> i got confused after i said let's gonna move on um oh look at the cute little fish and piranha piranha piranhas i think it's piranhas okay we're lagging a little bit here but this is a yeah type really this isn't a special yeah mega taiga it's like what is it called i know it's special but i don't know how Mega Taiga biome. Here's another cavey wave. Let's go ahead and hop in here. I usually can't find caves in Minecraft when I want them. So I just want to kind of look around the surface of these caves here and check them out and see if we can find anything helpful. Seeing as we already have some iron. We should be good for now, but I just want to make sure that we aren't missing anything. Oh, here's what, no, that's the hole we came out of. Uh, I want to do shaders too, but I think that would cause a little bit too much lag. Hello, skelly belly. You look a little creepy in this texture pack, but still kind of cool. Unless I'm lagging like insanity. Hey! Don't shoot, it's not nice. Don't shoot, don't shoot. Okay, there we go. I did also have the morph mod in this pack. But I decided against using it. This is a really cool room. It's like a little circular room. If you look at it on the mini map, it's a complete circle. This is super cool. Ah, oh, wow. Right, well, we found some more iron. And we got some bone. A bone. That was not worth it. We only got one bone. 
And we took a lot of damage. But at least now to conclude the episode, we have found some more iron. Uh, well, hey, even more iron. <laughs> I guess I was distracted by the skeleton, but I think this is about all the time we have for this episode. I hope you guys enjoyed and are excited for Teacup Craft to finally be back. Uh, I can't promise that it will be back officially, but hopefully it will be. 31 iron. Wow, what a way to end an episode. <laughs> and full of arrows. Well, thank you guys so much for watching this video. I hope you enjoyed. And if you did, please leave a like and share these videos with your friends. Um, yeah, I think that's about it. Thank you guys so much for watching this video. And I'll see you guys later. Bye!